So sometimes there are people they say, yeah, my pet bill is uh, not normal because he's uh, so dominant or she is so dominant against other dogs. Or they have such a high prey drive. Then first off, you did not do your homework because these dogs are hunting dogs. Uh, they are bred to hunt and to hunt under very hard conditions. So a shy, soft dog would never make it there. So they need to be highly prey driven to hunt of course and to keep hunting but also need to be dominant even in face of adversities. So one should be shame on you because you did not study what you got. The other thing is, okay, you're now in this position, so some people think, okay, let's uh, place my dog somewhere else and start all over again and make oftentimes the same mistakes again. This could be an option because if the dog yeah, is completely unfit uh, for the human, or more precisely, the human is unfit to be the boss of the dog, this could be a solution. The other solution is that you reschool yourself and understand where the dog is coming from and adjust yourself and also your perception of reality because it's your responsibility that you got the dog, especially your responsibility that you got the dog without even studying what you were getting. So this is normal, normal character and you can still channel that to some degree but you will never make it as good or easy on yourself as with a dog that did not have that properties if you don't like them. These properties, mind you, are very sought after, especially for the purpose that they are bred for. Without those qualities, they are not detrimental factors, but there are qualities in the breed as a pet dog terrier, they would not uh, be able to do their job and they are not extremely dog aggressive but they don't take crap and they don't uh, cower away when a big dog does something to them or try to dominate tries to dominate them so i hope this short video helps have a great day out